there's another PSN game I got. It's called Spare Parts. Not having a clue what to expect with this game, let's fire her up and see what the fuck she has to offer. PS3 standards, the graphics are subpar. I know it's a fucking PSM game, but even still, textures and shit are just not up to par. It does look like it's using anti-lacing though. Basically, you're a robot that is abandoned, and some annoying dude that is trying to sound like John Cleese tells you shit is going down, and the universe is doomed. Welcome to my ship. I am so pleased you are here. I'd calculated only a 3.2% chance anyone useful would ever turn up. My name is Conrad, and I am the ship's highly advanced computer intelligence. Unfortunately, we are all in grave danger, so I'll explain as we go along. As you go along, this fucker keeps interrupting you, like over and fucking over. I can control these hollow walls remotely, so I'll use them to make sure you find everything we need. Excellent. You pinpointed the ship part so I can teleport it here. Oh no, those are Crowfax troopers. Great. That's all the vital parts collected. Dude, shut the fuck up! I get it, collect everything! Fuck! So once I started really playing, hold up a sec, before I could get into this game, I got stuck. I accidentally left a tutorial early and wandered around the stinking ship trying to figure out what the fuck I was supposed to do. It was like 10 or 15 minutes later that I went back to do the tutorial again and this time finished it. Getting into the game, things felt straight up, it felt like Ratchet and Clank. Fuck, it even somewhat looks like it. So now I'm feeling like I'm playing a Ratchet and Clank game and it feels like a cheap knockoff. Gameplay is, well, when you jump it feels right. Fighting also feels okay. It's nothing extra. Nothing is really standing out. You'll be going around looking for, get this, spare parts to create weapons and power-ups to move you on through the game. <sighs> Fighting moves you can do, punching, kicking, and whatnot. It's boring, and I've already lost interest. For a PSN game, it's okay. I can't recommend it though. You can go out and find the first Ratchet and Clank for less than 20 bucks in a dunk bin in Walmart, which is far better. The art style is even the same. They say Krung never sleeps. It must be why he's always in such a foul mood. I wish Butterballs would just shut the fuck up. It's too much. Game's mediocre at best. Your kids may like it though, if you have any. It just don't do it for me. I'd rather a good RTS any day than this shit. And what the fuck is this? EA on the viewer screen? Fuck, now I hate this game. What a bunch of crooks. It's not cool to splash your logo in a game like this. A sports game, perhaps but not on the viewer screen of a spaceship. Do you know what it's like? It's like this. I'll prepare an away team. Data, Jordy, let's go. Mr. LaForge, are we close enough to use the visual acuity transmitter? We can certainly try it, sir. Please do. beginning to understand him. Alright, that's all I have to say. Basically, if you've played Ratchet and Clank, this is a cheap knockoff. And did I mention Origin is from the Devil? Google it if you don't know what it is. This is DTR. Communicate later, chumps. Arr.